from dodging bankruptcy to overcoming the COVID-19 pandemic. Wayne County Executive Warren Evans delivering his State of the County address and also making commitments and new investment into the county as well. Good evening. It's a great time to be in Wayne County. Executive Evans saying that the county government is in a strong position, touting its many progressive strides and all done under his leadership, dodging bankruptcy, tackling previous inefficiencies, getting through COVID-19 and transforming the county financially. Administration, we have enjoyed eight straight balanced budgets and budget surpluses each year and an A credit rating from Wall Street. Executive Evans also praising the county commission, which passed his $850,000 grant proposal, which funded the renovation of the historic Hamtramck Stadium, once the home of the Detroit Stars, who were part of a Negro National League. It's about more than simply economic development. It's about preservation and pride and legacy. Evans also announcing a new plan to address environmental health. The plan includes installing 100 new air monitors and 500 new air monitors for children as they plan to study asthma and air pollution. As for the polluters, let's just say the next time they apply for their permits, we'll be waiting with the data we need to hold them accountable. The environmental concerns that were addressed, we know that many of our residents deal with the issues of air quality, environmental injustice, um, as we highlighted, and we make sure that our, our Wayne County is a safe place to live, walk, play, and breathe. Executive Evans also declared a public health emergency as a result of the deteriorating conditions at the juvenile detention facility, aiming to work with the state of Michigan to address overcrowding issues. Reporting from Dearborn, Andre Ash, Michigan Chronicle.